Me. I'm Blair <laughs> and I'm doing my ethnography project and I decided to take my friend Asad or Asid Kevel. Asid Kevel. I'm also going to cook a traditional Indian dinner. Yeah? Okay, what are we cooking? We're gonna make some butter chicken and we're gonna eat it with naan which is uh, like a thick um, pita bread and we'll top it off with coconut rice which is actually um, a Kenyan, more of a Kenyan dish but my family's from Kenya so adding that in mixing and, and mixing all the flavors together in different cultures and we're gonna eat it with um, some masala chips. All right well it sounds good. Right now we are making some iced tea which is not a part of the project. And that, no, that's not part of the project. But we just, uh, we had to get a rotisserie chicken, and we just took all of the skin off, and we are getting ready, we're getting our spices ready to start the chicken. All right, aside, so what are we mixing together? I mix um, cinnamon and ginger and some chili pepper. And a little curry powder is going to make the base of the chicken. That's curry powder. Ooh, that is look pretty. Now Blair's chopping the onion. She's a professional onion chopper. And the sods over here, melting the butter. We're gonna we're gonna melt the butter, melt three the butter. tablespoons, and we're gonna add the onion in it and okay. let the onion caramelize. Okay. Once the onion turns into like a translucent, a translucent caramelized, not caramelized, just translucent. We're gonna add the spices and heat it all up so the spices become mixed, spi mixed and warm. So they sweat the out. Yeah, the yeah. onions have to sweat so that the spices can meld and mesh. <laughs> So we are putting the onions in the butter to caramelize them. Alright, so we are getting the onions to a nice caramelized state. And it already smells good with just the onions and butter. And over here we are doing... <laughs> uh, we were going to use brown rice, but we decided in the end to do white rice because it's unhealthy as well as gathers more flavor. So <laughs> we're going to use the white rice instead. Um, and Saad so opened up the coconut out. And now what are you going to do with that? I'm going to pour it into the pan, add the rice and some water, and let it cook. Sounds good. Stick your finger in there. I got cut last time I did this. You did? Yeah, and then bled. So we flubbed up and we forgot to shake it before we opened it, but it's okay because we're going to stir it. And that should hopefully do the same thing. Hopefully we'll get the same consistency. And we're still caramelizing over here. We're just about ready to start putting all of the uh, spices in. I think we should go for it. I think we should go for it too. Go for it. Sounds good. One tablespoon, so it's like two of these. No, I'll just do one of them. That would be a tablespoon. But you can do two. Look at how beautiful this is. It's so pretty. Yeah. All right, so we've just added the chicken, and it starts. It's starting to look delish. We just put some rice in the coconut milk. Well, is this your first time making the butter chicken? By myself? 
Yeah. And it's your first time making coconut rice. Yeah, that too. <laughs> I've had both of them all the time. All right, and here we have some naan to put in um, the oven. Uh, we got it frozen actually from Trader Joe's because we didn't think that we could make it that good by ourselves. We need a, like a brick oven to make it. Yeah, we need a brick oven to make it. Which we don't have, so this will do. Because we're just in a tiny apartment. Um, yeah, so we have the naan. We're going to put that in the oven, eat it with our butter chicken and coconut rice, yes. and it should be delish. So these are the chips that we're trying to recreate with the uh, potatoes that Assad had had in Kenya where they were fried, fried, right? And then um, they put lime juice over it and then chili powder, so. And they're pretty good. He's basting our naan. So dinner is ready. Why don't you dish it up? All right, so yeah, we're gonna shut up now. So we're gonna put the rice in. I think we have enough rice. And then put some of the butter chicken oh. over it. So now I can just add it around it. Now we take the naan and then we put it. On our plates. Mm. And there we go. What are you gonna do for um, butter get chicken? A baby. Butter chicken, coconut, uh, rice, uh, and uh, garlic uh, naan. Delicious. The British, uh, Delicious. British okay, so the best way to eat Indian uh well traditional way is to eat it with your hands. So we're gonna take the naan and just fold in some rice and chicken and it's so good. Do you agree? Yeah. I'm a fork. Hey. <laughs> she has a fork. She doesn't like to eat her hand. Dirty. No. But I can tell you. All right. So fingers. I have a clean plate. Um, Saw did pretty good. And Christy, because she only weighs 100 pounds, couldn't finish. No, it's because I had macaroni salad before this. And she's 98 pounds. And because she's 98 pounds. Pepper, yeah. Stop it. 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 side. it. Stop 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 it. Yum, yum, yum. Yum, yum, yum. This looks so good. <laughs>